I'm Richard Burton, Member of Parliament for Birmingham Northfield, and I'm here to do the rubble bucket challenge. Uh, what this means is that in a few moments I'm going to have a bucket of sand poured over my head. Why, you may ask, am I going to do this? Well, it's to support the Disasters Emergency Committee appeal for Gaza and medical aid for Palestinians. Over 2,000 Palestinians have been killed in the last few weeks. As well as that, there's been over 200 schools that have been damaged or destroyed. There's about 475,000 people that are displaced from their homes. And there's about 37,000 homes that are damaged over 17,000 homes that are actually uninhabitable at the moment. The reconstruction of Gaza is going to take years. And that's why we're asking everybody to give generously to medical aid for Palestinians, to buy much needed medical supplies for Palestinians, but also to the Disasters Emergency Committee so they can be, begin the reconstruction of Gaza. With that, I'm now going to completely humiliate myself <laughs> by having sand poured over my head. So that's for Gaza. My next job is rather more pleasurable. It's to nominate up to three other people to accept the Rubble Challenge. So I'm going to nominate somebody who's an old friend of mine, a campaigner against apartheid, a fellow Labour MP. I nominate Peter Hay. I also nominate a former Foreign Secretary of the United Kingdom who I was in Palestine with just a few, few months ago. I nominate Jack Straw, Emily. And finally, I want to nominate another friend, uh, Martin Linton, former Labour MP, now Director of Labour to Palestine, who was far too glowing and impressed by the fact that, my, that Andy Slaughter MP had nominated me to do this challenge. So if he thought it was good that I had to do it, Martin, now you have to do it yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Woo!